Next up, Cash from TaxGPT. Hello, everyone. Cash here from TaxGPT. We are creating an AI co-pilot for tax professionals and accountants. Did you know that American um, spent 6.5 billion hours annually on tax filing and inefficiencies in the system cost $260 billion to the system? Tax professionals are finding TaxGPT and automating their research questions and email generation with TaxGPT. Let me show you how. If someone comes to Mark with a complex tax question, he can ask that question to TaxGPT. TaxGPT not only answer the gold uh, instantly, but also provide gold standard sources as compared to ChatGPT or all the other free tools and suggest its questions. Um, for example, here's um, Mark is generating a tax memo that he needs to send it to a client about a QSPS explanation that could have taken him 30 minutes to write. He can write it within 30 seconds. But we're not only uh, tax generation, we are building a firm management and client management platform where we can see where uh, Mark, who's a tax profession, can see all of his team members and all of his clients. If a client asks a question, TaxGPT will have a context of all of their previous documents and all of their uh, tax situation. So we can generate an answer before Mark can lift a finger. And obviously, as a uh, tax professional, he has all the control. He can edit this response and send it to um, um, to, to the client. Um, we... Uh, in our product map, uh, roadmap, we are uh, launching the client management uh, platform this quarter, but we also have a DIY tax filing product for individual tax filers that we launched last month. In the future, we uh, plan to build complete automations on the tax preparation process and even white label tax GPT. We, we are at 22,963 annual run rate uh, in February. We're just starting to churn um, our, our sales motions. There are but Fortune 100 companies that are using tax GPT internally on an individual capacity, but we are trying to convert them into a paid pilot program and uh, promotions. Um, majority of our market, 86% of tax professionals work in under 30 people companies. So they are mom and pop shop. They're not building anything LM related in house. Uh, right now we are charging only $1,000 for annual license, but in the future it will go up to $5,000 annual license. There are three point four. 3.4 million tax professionals and accountants that give us a total addressable market of initial addressable market of 17 billion, but the actual addressable market is 260 billion uh, to in, in, increase, uh, to decrease the inefficiencies in the system. Uh, for in order to, for us to reach 10 million, we need to onboard 2,000 people. And in order to reach uh, 100 million, we need to onboard 20,000 tax professionals by 2029. Uh, right now, uh, our CAC is completely zero. Word of mouth, uh, search engine optimization, and social media. But in the future, we are planning uh, right now, we are um, partnering with CP Academy, National Road Agents of America. And we are in serious discussion with, uh, discussions with a Drake software that sells the, their software to already 100,000 tax offices and going to the industry specific conferences. Um, our competition is, uh, we don't see them as a competition, we do see them as a partners because they are on the tax filing side of the business. We are automating the ta tax provision side of the business and embedding AI into daily workflows to decrease the time spent on mundane tasks for tax professionals and accountants. I previously worked for Adobe, so I have experience building enterprise grade software. I'm personally getting a um, tax provider license. Isabella previously worked for Oracle, uh, went to Berkeley. She's an AI cybersecurity expert in the house. Andrew is our founding CPA. He previously worked for Deloitte and uh, we have amazing Jason as an investor. TaxGPT is building an AI co-pilot for tax professionals. Thank you so much. All right. Thanks, Cash. Hey, I'm curious about what's your data source to train a model for, for this TaxGPT? And the second question is, what's a long-term goal for your product? Currently, I think you focus more on tax prep. Would you co ever consider to expand to let tax fighting uh, in long term? So I've spent a bunch of time looking at GAI. I, my biggest question is always the same. How do you build a proprietary moat around something that has an open engine? Right, like you're going to run the same engine as others, and ultimately you can claim that the data you have access to gives you a moat. But I have not been convinced of that. Secondly, every major player, every legacy player, has to be looking at how to fold this in. I don't love the why won't so and so do this, but since every major company is under threat and is figuring out how to use GAI, I mean, it does not seem like an enormous stretch for Intuit or whoever owns TurboTax these days to invest in an open AI license and to, to put in the expertise to be able to do this. And all of a sudden, you're obviated as a startup that doesn't have any value to somebody when they can use their existing legacy player. So how do you think about the... I know you want to partner with them, but do they even need to partner with you? They can just build it. Thank you so much. Estella, so answer to the question of data source, we um, 
scrap all the legal anything that impact the tax code um like irs tax code all the state tax code any uh, tax code judgments all of that uh, we scrap that but also we have proprietary information like we have uh, tax professionals asking um questions we close to 20000 question at this point so we get their feedback on every question and we triangulate that information and uh, keep uh, keep building that flywheel of the data mode uh, that's um, you know proprietary on that a uh, long term vision in terms of tax filing uh, it's not out of the question i think uh, ai has um, given us so much creativity like uh, previously like wk of the world there is 40 billion dollar company we are able to accomplish that in a very very lim- uh, small team and limited amount and everything so tax filing i think can be rebuilt from scratch um the system and it can probably will be built much better but that is more like series a b type of uh, probably uh, decision that we have to make then um yes uh, so i partially answered the question like what is the proprietary data set that we have rather than the legal data sources um so we are you know collecting the feedback on every question and these are tax professionals like for example if you go to thomson reuters and bloomberg what is proprietary do they have they have their own uh, you know 20 people team that is you know providing the tax opinion they they call it second resources that is explaining explaining the law we have much better cha- you know much larger tax professional a thousand tax professionals right now that are giving us feedback that we are building our proprietary data uh, mode and yes uh, like intuit of the world and all the other people of the world yes uh, they can build this uh but they haven't built it so far that's why we had forex for hire offered and we rejected it as and uh, you know there is a uh, time for us to build it thank you so much happy to answer the questions later all right thanks so much cash